In the spring of 2016, the city of Fort McMurray, Alberta was ravaged by wildfires, forcing thousands of residents from their homes, including a then 13-year-old Sebastian Kosa, now the top-ranked CHL goalie for the draft. I think I slept with my bedroom door open that night in case uh, someone was going to come knock on our door to tell us if we had to evacuate or not. But um, the next day I went to school, went out for lunch. Um, the sky was red. Um, you know, obviously uh, a lot of kids were getting picked up at that point. Kosa's family packed up what they could before evacuating with the rest of the community. The golf clubs and the hockey bags are in there first. Um, you know, you're, you're taking the laundry, uh, all the dirty clothes you're wearing because those are the ones you actually wear. Everything that you can't, can't afford to lose, obviously. It's, it's all the pictures, all the memories you're going to be losing. With the fires rapidly spreading, the highway south was bumper to bumper, making a typical five-hour drive last throughout the night. We left our house at 4 o'clock and we got into Edmonton at uh, about 7.30 the next morning. Um, you know, a lot, definitely a lot of things going through your head. Obviously, the, the city you've grown up in, it's, it's going up in flames, so, uh, you know, it's can't, can't say much, you know, it, uh, Hard to describe the feeling, but uh, you know, definitely, definitely anxious and, and uh, you know, curious what's going to happen. You, you want to go home. Fortunately, the Kosa family home was spared, but they still spent nearly three months away living with relatives in Calgary. It's an experience that helped shape the six foot seven Kosa into the elite goaltender he is today. With Hayden Pros to Hayden, he's Rob Kosa. Kind of cliche, but you know, controlled controllables. Um, you know, obviously, there's nothing, nothing you can do there. Um, you know, luckily for me, uh, you know, the edge school uh, was taking people in from Fort Murray, so you know, I, I went there, I trained, I, uh, I finished my schooling there that year, and I'm just exactly just trying to make the best situation out of out of a bad one for sure.